So here's the deal. My boy Mad Child came out with another one. I hit him up on uh, goddamn Twitter and told him when you drop this bitch, a reaction's gonna come. And what the fuck he did? Seems like my life been really changing on me. I know some niggas out here hating on me. Hey, I see the bitches how they changing on me. I know some niggas out here snaking on me. Hey, see like he liked it. He fucks with me, Mad Child fucks with me. I fuck with him too, you know what I'm saying? So we might as well go ahead and get into another goddamn reaction. Now, usually when I do reactions by myself, I usually got the angle where I turn this way and everything else. I ain't trying to do all that today. I just want to go ahead and drop this motherfucker because it came out. I need to get it out to y'all, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but shit, before we get anything closer, then move on further. I need y'all like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. I got a giveaway I'm going to do at 5,000. And then I got a giveaway I'm going to do at 10,000 subs. 5,000 subs and 10,000 subs. So if we can run it up, Somebody gonna win something. At, at 10,000 subs, somebody gonna win a goddamn iPhone 12. You know what I'm saying? We run that up, I got you. I'm gonna buy iPhone 12 and I'm gonna give it to you. You know what I'm saying? You gonna win it. At, at 5,000 subs, I'm gonna make it some free t shirts or something. You know what I'm saying? For free t shirts that I make. Because we do make t shirts. If you ain't already checked out the goddamn uh, Instagrams called, I think it's, damn, I don't even know what the fuck the page called. Let me get it real quick because I'm gonna be like, damn. How you got an Instagram page about your pictures and you don't even know what the fuck it is? Okay, I understand that. It's cool, but don't judge me. You know what I'm saying? Don't you? I think it's called Shirt You Design. If I'm not mistaken, Shirt You Design. Yeah, Shirt You Design on Instagram. I'll put the link up. I'll, I'll do it. I'll drop You know how I do it. But anyways, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Let's get to it, though. I was on drugs. We finna find out what's going on. Hey. He said was on drugs. That mean he ain't in drugs no more. That's what's up. That mean he living a good life. That's what's up. Uh -huh. Hey, he coming in on this one, you know what I'm saying? He coming in on this one. He said he was on drugs, people used to hold him down, everything else. Now, I can't speak on anything else because if I say something, I might be wrong. I got to hear more about the shit when he's talking about people held him down. They made it held him down in the wrong way. They made it held him down like, hey, I'm going to supply you with these drugs and keep him doped up. I hope not because, nigga, no, I hope nobody ever just be doped up like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you're on drugs, if you're really bad on drugs, I'm not talking about weed. I'm talking about pills, Zans, whatever the fuck y'all be doing. Let that shit go. Drop that shit. Now, let it go. I'm pretty sure it's fucking your life up. I ain't ever popped a pill to know. How it feels to be happy with a pill, none of that shit. So I'm good on that. But if it's, I'm pretty sure you're having fun. But whatever y'all do, man, let that shit go. Please let it go. Exactly. Huh. <laughs> Hold up, wait a minute. Hold up, match. I ain't know you came like this. I know you rap, bro, but you really spitting your shit on this. I fucks with this one for real. I really fucks with this shit. But look, hold on before we go on that. Because, nigga, you spitting. But hold on, wait, let's talk about that, bro. You spitting. You understand that? You spitting. Spitting, spitting. I ain't know you came like this. I done heard some few songs, and you spit too. But you really spit on this one. So, look, I got to give you your props on that one. But anyways, let's get back to what he's saying. So, look, yeah, people. When, when, yeah, of course people going to hold you down when you have drugs. They going to try to... Supply you with the shit. They want to see you fuck up. They want to see you go down the hill, the the hill, the whatever the fuck train got. I don't know what the fuck I'm trying to say. They just want to see you go down. Of course uh, they want to because shit, they probably on drugs too. They're in the low place. They want you in that low place too. They want to see you fail. You know what I'm saying? But look at you. Now you fucking prospering. Now you got here making your money. You ain't on drugs no more. I can tell you ain't on drugs no more. You know what I'm saying? You look like you just got your mind straight, like you got your mind right. You focused on your shit. You doing your goddamn uh, music. You focused on your shit. So you got to keep pursuing this shit. So I want to sound proud of your motherfucking ass for getting off of drugs. And everybody else who's watching this, if you're on something, get off of that shit. You don't need it. I promise you, life is way more better just when you're high on weed. And I can't say drinking and shit like that, but I do drink, you know what I'm saying? But life ain't better like that, because when I get fucked up sometimes when I'm drunk, I act stupid. We all do, so we don't need to do that. So we just get away from everything and just keep pursuing your dreams. Guys, okay? I'm a fortunate one. I be one to push everyone. Ah. Hey. <laughs> uh. I was on drugs. I was on drugs. <laughs> Girlfriend, in real life was a low life her whole life. Ah. Uh. I was getting high, I was getting low, that's a pouty face, a 
Hey man, so look, the chick that he had, she was in low life, you know what I'm saying? She was on drugs and everything. That's why I said, you know what I'm saying? I ain't say it, I said it in my head, but two people on drugs, no, shit ain't gonna work. If somebody's hooked on this and you're hooked on that, it'll never work. That relationship will never work. How do you expect that shit to work? It's not gonna work, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just doesn't make no sense how people can think that they can be in a relationship and it's only based off of drugs. I guarantee you it's only based off of drugs. If drugs weren't involved, y'all probably wouldn't fuck with each other like that, you know what I'm saying? You probably wouldn't. I hate to see it. Anybody on drugs. Strong guy. I used to see my cousins all the time. My older cousins all the time fucking fucked off on drugs and shit. That shit made me cry. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, damn. And my cousin's like, damn, you crying? I'm like, hell yeah, my nigga. Because I, I, I had to see you from my own eyes. How you inhale some shit. How you do some shit. You know what I'm saying? That shit fucked my heart up. And I hate that people are strung out on anything. So I hoped and prayed to God that all you guys will sit here and... Just get off of drugs. Just get off of everything you're supposed to get off. Just do what you're supposed to do and only what you want to do and should do. You're not saying what you want to do because a lot of people want to get drugs, Zans, all this other shit. But no, you got to get away from that shit. And like again, man, I child, I'm proud of you, my nigga, because you got off that shit. Bros from the powder taste, couldn't feel my face. Now I'm God's gift, see the fog glyphs, say it's all good. No, it's not. Ah. Uh. I was on drugs, I was on drugs. <laughs> <laughs> but say like, he felt like Scarface. Y'all remember when Scarface hauled that cocaine in front of him? He was just. You know, so I ain't never did coke. I ain't never did shit with smoke weed, so I wouldn't know. But it's just funny to hear that part because I remember that goddamn episode. I mean, I remember that section of that motherfucking movie. That nigga was high on drugs. and nigga was taking him just. Okay, you wanna play? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That nigga was on it. But shit, bad child, man. I'm glad you realized that that shit went for you. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad you realized that your life is way more better than what you what it was before. Now that you're doing, you're pursuing your dreams and shit. Drugs ain't for nobody. Drugs is not for anybody at all. Nobody. Nobody should be taking drugs. Yeah, whenever you get into a wreck, they fucking prescribe you pills and everything else. But if you don't take them, host, then yeah, you're gonna be in pain. But shit, I'd rather be in pain and be strung out on some shit, you know what I'm saying? I take the pain, I got into a wreck, I was prescribed 180 pills from the jump. I never got the motherfucking uh, prescription filled because that's not me, you know what I'm saying? Everybody say, oh, you could've got the pills, you could've sold them. For one, that's not me, I ain't never sold drugs. For two, why would I sit here and get my pills for other people to sell to fuck somebody else up, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get away from not even being addicted to anything, you know what I'm saying? So why the fuck would I do that to somebody else? That's stupid, you know what I'm saying? No, I would never do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm in pain right now talking to y'all as I'm speaking. Does it bother me? Yeah, but fuck it. I don't need drugs. I got my goddamn beer. <laughs> fuck everything else. Get up, pills, did a lot of pills, did a lot of hey. Okay, line it up. I rode that train till the wheels fell off. I rode that train till my time was up. I was on drugs. I was on drugs. I did a lot of drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> What'd he say? Hold up, wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, hold up. Wait, you got something? <laughs> he said, wait, you got something? <laughs> you tripping, bro. Hey, that's a beautiful ass scene right there. Okay, God. <laughs> I fucks with this, mad child. I fucks with this, bro. You did your goddamn thing. That shit crazy. Niggas really be out here on drugs like that, man. You know what I'm saying? He said, why you got some? <laughs> that shit is funny. <laughs> but like I said, man, he said he was on a lot of goddamn drugs, too. He said, that shit's funny at the end. He said, man, I was on a lot of drugs. I'm pretty sure you probably did everything, bro. Every goddamn thing. But at the end of the day, the people, this is a goddamn blessing because he's done everything probably as he told you. You know what I'm saying? The song. He said he did Zan, cocaine, did all that shit. You know what I'm saying? And now look at him. He's still pursuing his dream. Now he's getting his bag. Probably way more money than he's getting before and whenever he was doing coke and all that other shit. I don't know. I don't know his life like that. Man, child, if I'm wrong, I know you probably gonna watch the video, but if I'm wrong, let me know. But I'm pretty sure you probably made way more money now than what the fuck you was doing whenever you had drugs. You know what I'm saying? And now you got the money to fucking buy the drugs. And that's good that you're not on drugs no more, bro. So I'm proud of you. Everybody needs to get the fuck off of drugs. Drugs is not cool at all. 
big farmer out here making buku money because y'all want to give y'all money to them because y'all want to feel some type of way and whenever y'all feel some type of way that's not even the life that y'all supposed to live y'all not supposed to be strung out and fucked up and in your mind and all this other shit you're supposed to be paying attention with the fuck's here on earth because it's the only shit that matters this is what molds us this is what happens this is what you get you know what i'm saying like this is life right here drugs doesn't need to be involved with nothing you know what i'm saying people are probably gonna be like well what about marijuana marijuana is not a drug if i can fucking take a plant put it in the dirt and i can grow it myself there's no motherfucker, that's not a drug. That's natural, you know what I'm saying? There's natural motherfucking plants out here that goddamn, you take it, it'll heal you, you know what I'm saying? Aloe vera, all that shit, do something for your body, you know what I'm saying? That That's that's what it's supposed to be. It's not supposed to be big pharma, like, hey, boom, I'ma sit here and motherfucking give you some pills. Another thing, too, how is it that, you know, you got big mamas and grandmas, this is the black people, you know what I'm saying? Big mamas and grandmas, even, even white people, it's not race things, it's just people, period. How you got your grandma, your people, Anybody telling you, don't bring these drugs in my house if you sell drugs and shit like that. But they will send your ass to goddamn Walgreens to go pick up their prescription. That's the biggest dope deal in the goddamn world and that bitch on every goddamn block. But you can't make that money. That's dumb. Yo, people can't bring in, which I'm not condoning, you know what I'm saying? People selling drugs and shit, I'm not condoning none of that shit. I'm just saying, don't trip on somebody bringing in some money selling drugs off the street when you're going to go give your money to the goddamn people down the street. It's the same goddamn thing. Think about that. Get out them drugs. Shout out.